Okay, so now let's look, uh, take a look at the arpeggios of the first solo of Into the Unknown. Uh, it starts with uh, an economy picking lick on the last two strings, E and B. So let me play it and then break it down for you. Okay, so this is a long sequence, but I'm gonna break it down bit by bit. It starts here with a major seven, A major seven arpeggio on two strings. I start with an upstroke, if you know it closely, and then up, down, down. Basically, that's the principle of economy picking. So up, down, down, up. And when you end with an upstroke, you continue, you start off again, cycle with an upstroke again. This is actually a pretty good exercise for you to practice, maybe isolate it here and work on that first before you move on to the next one. So, and then you move up here. And then E major seven here. So, And then I do a descending lick here on C sharp. And I play some harmonic and some uh, chromatic passages. I start again with an upstroke, up, down, down, and then I continue with alternate picking for the rest of the lick. So basically it's this shape here. No here, same note. And I use it here on purpose because it creates a nice effect. Ends with a bend here on the 21st fret. And when I'm, it's kind of hard to do, but you should practice that one. When you're here and bending a whole step up, you put your pinky right next to the next fret. You can tap as well, but I prefer to do it with my pinky. So this is the main sequence of the first solo.